Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Thursday, 15th of September by our graduate students and global instructors. These are the trades by Kasra, who's uh, trading YM, uh, which is the futures contract of Dow Jones Industrial Average. And you see he's doing fast scalp on YM. This is his one minute chart. And when it aligns with the higher time frames, then that creates high probability trading area and you see here channel that is aligned with uptrend major trend and he entered properly after pullback got completed based on algo four and five and enters with the quickest scalp here so this is the core of the trend then again the trend is still valid but the momentum is less and he's taking again position here and enters long and takes profit here. Uh, price couldn't uh, hold the support area and got rejected from support and went back again to test the resistance so the trend was resumed in higher time frames. So you can see this again, similar to previous one, the same range. This range is almost constant and one can draw it here, the middle, and enter repeatedly here and take profits at these points the higher area of channel and that's what he did so let's see the result of these fastest scalps he has very high profit factor of 43 because the win rate is high that the win to loss ratio is very high also that results win to loss ratio of 12 with high win rate gives very high profit factor and very small drawdown uh, this is suitable for fund providers who wants you to have a small drawdown and also they want you to have a consistency rule and so that's reason most of us uh, use fast scalps to grow those accounts using fund providers because we have more limitations and they want us to have a more linear uh, equity curves uh, this trade was shared by easy uh, who's shorting us 500 after seeing that uh, this channel on 30 minute macro chart was uh, showing the price got rejected and now there's opportunity to see the downtrend in the middle chart of five minute which is a structural chart and take its pullback so he uses one minute chart to repeatedly scalp uh, in the same direction of five minutes which is the high probability trading area after this breakout uh, he entered here with proper stop loss and exit strategy number one. Again, waited for the pullback to be completed. Again, another entry and another exit. Thanks, Easy, for sharing your trades with us. These are trades shared by Ren. The major trend is downtrend, and there was a big major pullback to form this channel, and he found that uh, this is a good area that the sellers came back and the pullback got completed. So entered here one position, again the price retested close to this level, got rejected and he re-entered another position and then uh, closed both of them uh, on the other side of channel close to the dynamic support line with good profit. Thanks Ren for sharing your trades with us. Uh, these trades were shared by Yan, a global instructor that is uh, looking at 10 minute charts to see the pattern and then the alignment with one minute charts. Uh, both are in downtrend and a complex pullback got completed and the price is uh, finding uh, downward pressure. So he sees this as an opportunity to scalp fast using five second charts and repeatedly scalp uh, based on I'll go for three, four, and five, and managing the exits by ATM actively. So these are clips from live trades taken. And the price is trying to break this support area. Looks like divergence. Okay.
Okay, broke it. And he needs to see if there's any pullback to re-enter again. So scalping repeatedly with fast, quick scalp. All exits are managed by uh, Ninja Trader ATM because there's not much time to manage manually underfoot. So that's the summary of his trades. Was taken 25 trades with 88% win rate and profit factor of 2.3. That's his trade for today. So thanks, Yan, for sharing your trades. Now, these are some of my trades. Uh, at the beginning, the market was in sideways and there was no trend. So Algo One doesn't pass the volatility filter, prevents us to trade. After breaking these channels, I came back. So there was a high volatility filter and non-trendy was very dangerous to trade and it results in a loss. Uh, there was a quick breakout here, but again market went to the sideways. So I'm breaking, waiting for this to break because this doesn't give much profit unless it breaks. So it seems it's breaking because buyers are coming back and you can see evidence of the buy pressure so then I add more position and go aggressively for position and it's closed here again re-entering now the price has room to test this area this area and go all the way here okay So waiting for more pullbacks. Okay, limit and small scalp. The ATM can manage this. If the buyers come back quickly, it close with fast profit. More pullbacks. Now the price is testing this second swing, waiting for pullbacks again to re enter. Long position. ATM close with break even. Adding first one position and see the buyers are coming back. We see some buyers here, so we need to add more position. Okay, the volatility within each bar is high, so ATM close it manually with break even. So I think now we are actually close to this level and this level so that's reason uh, the buyers cannot um, break this easily so i stop it here with uh, good profit in 10 minutes so that was for the beginning of the day so i usually come back again at the end of market to trade for 10 to 20 minutes and scalp it like this quickly thanks for your attention Hope these trades are useful for you to see application of path system on different markets, different time frames, and a style of trading. And let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.